What is awakening? Awakening is waking up from a long, lucid, realistic dream and realizing that you've always been this untouched, infinite, immortal consciousness. That all the struggles and trials and tribulations of the dream were just that. They were just a dream. Sometimes the dream was like a nightmare. Sometimes it was like a, a wonderful experience. Sometimes it seemed never ending. Sometimes it seems as if you were trapped. Sometimes it's dark, sometimes it's light. But that's just the nature of the dream. Awakening is waking up and realizing that it was all just a dream. It was all an illusion. A very real feeling and real experiencing illusion. It's a paradox. But it was just a dream. And after you've awakened, you realize that everything is fine. That you're still untouched, you're still pristine. Everything is fine. There are no wounds, there is no history. There are no struggles. There's no pain, there's no suffering. There's just absolute bliss, peace. Everything is fine. We experience awakening when we're willing to surrender the dream, when we're willing to let go of the dream, when we're willing to give up the dream. When nothing, absolutely nothing, is more important than waking up from the dream. So awakening makes us feel clean, renewed after that long dream. In Christianity, it's called a state of grace. When we surrender, give up the dream and surrender into the infinite, into the true self. We end up experiencing that profound inner peace, that bliss that is the nature of the true self. That's the after effect of awakening or one of the attributes of awakening. There is no greater gift than awakening. And then of course there's always the next step. The next step is living the true self living the infinite consciousness that we are on a day-to-day -day basis in human life. That's where it's not quite as easy. We're surrounded by distractions. We're surrounded by events that demand our attention. We're filled with human emotions that demand our attention. And it's normal. It's fine. We learn to watch them. We learn to be mindful. We learn to see everything as it is, without judgment, without desire, 
without preconceptions. We learn to observe objectively. And we learn to be the observing and not the observer. Experiencing awakening is incredibly simple. It's just a matter of absolute, total, and complete surrender. It's not easy, but it's very simple. It's frightening to imagine letting go of everything, having no desires, letting go of any sense of control, scares the ego. But others have done it before us. And we do it too. I hope this is helpful. There will be more. I'll answer more questions. Feel free to send me your questions through the website or at reachout at lifesanswers.org. I'll do my best to answer as many as possible with these little videos. I'm learning. I'm learning how to do these videos. I'll do my best. Take care for now. Goodbye.